Hello guys, in this video, we are going to see about a new tool that is inbuilt with Poly Linux. It's called Net Discover. So here's the tool. It is a command line interface tool. So if you see this, it's already opening in help section, help command, opening with the help command. So I find I to search my two device network devices. So minus one range to give a range of instead of auto scan. So like this all we can see see using this net discover. So okay. So I want to list an IPs that connected to my networks. So I just use net T A S C O P E R. And so I don't want to just give any inputs so command line. So just press enter. So I will start capturing from 192.168 all the IPs connected to my router so it will search all the ips so i'm using virtual machine so my computer has a limited number of ip assigned to this virtual machine yeah so this is a long process so if you want you even your virtual machine or in your computer want to list quickly how many devices what are the ip are connected to a router just you need to install an one software just I'm in a root directory. So if you're not in root directory, make SUDO code to become an root directory. So I'm going to install so apt install a or p scan. Just pressing enter. So it installed without any error. So I want to start the ARP scan. So ARP SCKR scan. So I want to list devices. So command is hyphen m. So when I enter is look at this. In net discover, see it find out the same what we have find it here. It just discover what are the IPs connected to our computer. It will check every IPs. Okay. It will take so much of the time. So in auto scan, we can get in just 10 seconds so if we get now so that why net discover will assign this ip sorry not assign get this ip from this auto scan so we know that 10.2.2.2 is our ip address so uh, i mean basically 10.2 is our gateway so 2.3 and 2.4 these are two types of ip address is connected to my router. This all virtual machine generated IP address. In case if you are in uh, connected to Wi-Fi network, it will be something like uh, 192.168, like 172.16, like this. You're going okay. So I want to know which is my router IP address. So my router IP address. I want to just type O U T E route. See when I type route. So it's the showing the destination way. So 10.0.22 is router gateway. So this is known as router's IP address. Okay, I will get the router's IP address. So another way to get is A R P hyphen A. To get C 10.0.2 at this MAC address get the ETH flow. So we get the router's IP address with MAC address. So this is the easy way to gather the information uh, that uh, devices connected to our router. IP address and MAC address. So using this both, we can do anything we want because we're going to see what is the power of MAC address. So I'm just try to telling you that Net Discover is also a program that will collect all the IP address in our router from A to Z. But ARP Scan is a mini program that will show what are the IP address that connected into a, into my router that already stored in my router. So if you are going to a public network, if you are using ERP scan, it will not work. So you, uh, otherwise you will get a uh, lot of IP address. So I want a uh, live IP connections. Okay. So using this net discover, we can find live IP connections with MAC address. See, the MAC address starting to ending all same. So this only changes because this MAC address is generated by virtual machine. Okay guys, in this video, we have, we have seen this net discover and ERP scan. So ERP means nothing address resolution protocol so it is a protocol which ip address and mac address combined with the, to send from one packet to another packet so packet means so every in the internet 
everything will be called as packet every data sent from one place to another place they were in by sending packets so if you don't know don't worry we will see how this in network section okay guys so i want to clear that you net discover and erp scan defense so on how to find a gateway so it will help you to use in erp spoofing okay guys thanks for watching so next video we are going to click the router and hack the victim victim computer and say i am the router so send the information to me i will send to the internet so next video we are going to see about erp spoofing thanks for watching guys